Today marks the official reveal date for the DJI NEO 2, DJI's anticipated successor to the ultra-compact NEO drone. While the company has teased the event with the tagline, Stay in Control, briefly posted on their socials before removal, the launch is structured as a China-first rollout. Global availability is delayed, with Europe targeted for November 13, 2025, and the U.S. facing significant hurdles due to ongoing FCC regulatory issues and potential bans on new DJI products. This could make the NEO 2 the last DJI drone to receive U.S. FCC approval under the current administration. The reveal focuses on the Chinese market, where sales are expected to begin immediately following today's announcement. Leaks and hands-on images from reliable sources like Igor Bogdanov at Quadro News have provided a clear picture of the drone's design and specs in the lead-up, confirming major upgrades for beginners and prosumer users. U.S. pricing for the original NEO has already dropped to as low as $159 in response to the hype. Key Leaked Specifications Based on aggregated leaks from FCC filings, packaging photos, and insider reports, weighs just 135 grams under FAA registration limits. Top-mounted battery for easier swaps, similar to larger DJI models. Redesigned body with upward and backward-facing cameras for enhanced obstacle avoidance and smart return-to-home functionality. Includes a new LiDAR sensor and infrared for 360-degree obstacle detection. Camera and video. Upgraded to a two-axis gimbal with a 1.1.3-inch CMOS sensor, potentially borrowed from the DJI Mini 5 Pro. Supports 4K 60fps video, 10-bit HDR, and D-Log M color profiles for better low-light performance and post-production flexibility. Flight performance, 15% larger battery capacity, extending flight time to 19 minutes, up from the original NEO's 18 minutes. Quieter propellers and improved AI subject tracking with gesture and voice controls. Enhanced OcuSync connectivity for better range with DJI remotes. Safety and features, AI-powered tracking, auto return enhancements, and no need for a separate controller palm launch capable like its predecessor. Pricing and bundles, U.S. estimates subject to confirmation. Pricing leaks vary slightly by region, but here's a breakdown based on recent reports. Note, these are pre-ban estimates. U.S. availability may require imports. From recent X posts and Reddit threads, excitement is high, but tempered by realism. Overall, sentiment is 80% positive, it's seen as a must-upgrade for original owners, scoring 4.5 out of 5 in leak-based hypotheticals for value and innovation. If you're a casual flyer dipping into FPV or need a pocket cinematographer for traveler vlogs, the DJI NEO 2 looks like a no-brainer, smarter, steadier, and way more capable than its predecessor, all while keeping that launch-from-your-hand magic. At $259, it's aggressively priced to dominate the sub-250G market, especially if DJI nails the holiday stock. But if US regs bite, or you crave pro specs, hold off for the Mini 5 Pro. I'll be watching the October 30 reveal closely. Expect real-world tests to confirm if it lives up to the hype. I'm really excited about the release of the DJI NEO. I already own the previous version, and I love it. What about you? What are your thoughts on the DJI NEO 2? If you're new to my YouTube channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Bye!